after you've purchased the QI macros, you'll see a receipt here. And if you scroll down a little ways, you'll see a sign that says, click here to download the product. If you fail to download, when you order the QI macros, you should get an email from orders at qimacros.com that looks a lot like this. All you have to do is click here to download now. And the QI macros will go out and bring up a, a menu. You can click here to download the product. When you click on it, in Excel XP, it will open up a little menu like this. Just simply save it. Or if you're in Windows, there'll be a little bar down at the bottom. So we're going to save that, qimacros.zip. Make a note of where you're saving it. In Windows 7, it will store it in Downloads. So here I'm storing it in QI Macros, so maybe I just want to go up to uh, my desktop here. I'll just put it on my desktop. Save. And it'll download. And we want to open it. And here you'll see we have the Mac files in here, so if you're on a Macintosh, you'd go in there. And if you're on the PC, go into the QI Macros zip folder here. And here you'll see the QI Macros setup file. If you double click on that, you just want to run that. And it'll tell you that we've got a qualified application here. And it'll ask you if you have multiple copies of Excel, it'll ask you where you want to install it. In my case, I'm going to install it in Excel XP. It'll just accept most of these messages, and it'll go ahead and install the software out there for you. Click OK. So when you open up Excel, you'll see the QI macros up here on the top of the menu for Excel 2007 to 13 and also in the earlier versions of Excel and also in the Mac. So look on top of Excel for the QI macros.